Okay, so the problem is when it boots, you'll get this error page. So what we're gonna do is plug in the USB drive with the Windows 7 installation and reboot the computer. As the computer is starting to boot, start tapping F11. That should bring up your boot menu. We're looking for the one down here that says U or UEFI colon and then the name of your thumb drive. In this case, it's a sand disk. Click enter and the Windows installation will begin. Click next on the language defaults. And when you get to this screen, click on the repair your computer. This will start a search for different Windows installations. There should only be one. Should be Windows Embedded Standard. You don't need to click on it, but just click next. The recovery tool we're going to use is command prompt. When the command prompt comes up, type BCD edit and then hit enter. Now we're going to look down through this Windows bootloader and look for the device partition C. Should have the path as Windows System 32 windload.efi. So when we find that, we're gonna look for the identifier. It should be default. So down here, we're gonna type BCD edit space hyphen set space and then a open curly bracket default, which is this identifier, close curly bracket, and then no integrity checks, plural, all one word. So no integrity checks, space, and then the number one, hit enter. It should say the operation completed successfully. At this point, you can remove your thumb drive, reboot the computer, and it should boot up and resume installing the Windows updates.